Hello, welcome everyone. We are here with Dima. Hi. And we will show you how laser scanning helps prepare even tricky parts for a flawless welding. We will show you everything from the scanning to a finished seam. And we will demonstrate that this technology is a game changer. So let's get into it. Simple question, laser scanning. We do it in the shops when we scan our products. Bing! Right? Is this similar? Well, in some sense. So laser scanner is actually the eyes of the robot. Right. And uh, there are two main parts in it. The laser projector. Yeah, there's a red beam there. Yeah, red beam yes. over there, so you can uh -huh. see the line. Uh, very good, yeah. yeah. And uh, there is also a camera that captures the line and uh, by the deviations of this line, it measures the distance to it. So basically it measures like the profile, the height profile uh -huh. of an object that is be below the scanner. So for example, if I put my fingers here, you can see them on my screen, all right? So these are my three fingers. All right. So now I bend it one, there are two. And if I move them closer or further, This is far more sophisticated than a barcode scanner in a shop, right? Yeah, yeah. Uh huh. Yeah. I saw your three, uh, three of your fingers in perfect uh, uh, portrayal there, yes? Yeah. Cool. Yeah, so uh, here you can see my wow. fingers, but yes. if uh, it's installed on the robot and you move the robotic arm, uh -huh. you can stitch all the profiles together mm. and get the 3D point cloud of a, of a part. Mm. Actually, we scan the neighborhood of a sim, mm. and uh, in this way we can uh, get the very accurate uh, like shape of the, of the joint that we want to weld. So, and in this way, our system can analyze this point cloud and adapt uh, to the deviations of the part. Very good. So today, uh, we're going to test our system on a part with deformations. Mm -hmm. And let's go, I'll show you how it differs from the model. Let's go. So we have our parts. Uh, to the naked eye, they're the same but I'm guessing they're similar, but different. Yeah, they're yeah. actually different. So this uh -huh. one is exactly as in the model. All right. And this one is deformed. Okay. So this part and this part are inclined a little yes. bit. So if we measure distances uh -huh, here. The calipers. Yeah. Right. So it's one yeah. inch here. Just over 1.3 is here. Oh, more. Yeah. And... Uh-huh. Five inches here. Yeah. Bit and more. Uh, Five point uh -huh. one here. So it's, this one isn't even. You can't see it with the naked eye, but with your tool. Yeah. Yes. So, okay. but we can weld it perfectly mm -hmm. because of the line scanner. Our system can adapt. Mm-hmm. Wonderful. Okay. So uh, let's create a chart to weld that uh, deviated part. So this is our model. Uh, the first thing that we need to do is to select the, the wells uh, with deviations. If you remember, this point and this point are deviated, so we are selecting these uh, two wells. We need to make sure that in the system settings uh, we turned on the line scanner, mm -hmm. that we can select the speed, and uh, uh, here you can see the points uh, that the scanner are gonna scan. I, I selected these two seams because uh, they are on the deviated parts of our of our model. When you say select, do you have to drag your cursor no. across? No, you can just select it like this. Just one click. One click, Boom. yes. Okay. One click, so I delete uh -huh. this one. And uh, that's it, yeah. So you can, if you are really interested, you can see uh, the points through which uh, the scanner should like go to, to scan all these points because we're going to use these points to, to match the actual point cloud with the geometry of the model that we have here in our system. 
Okay, when, the, uh, when we have uh, our sims selected, we just click Run at Work Zone and we can start here. Great. Where is the thinking going on here? Uh, the software? Uh, it's in a badge box uh, yeah. over there, so there's our server right. and uh, all the computations are in there. In the badge box? Yeah, in the badge box. So I added uh, our task to the cell. Mm -hmm. uh, so the first run, we're going to do dry run, just to see that we are like precisely doing the, our well. And uh, this nozzle, we'll do a dry run along yeah, the yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. And uh, the next one will be actual welding. Great. So let's scan it. Okay, what have we here? Uh, so this, I told you before that uh, we are taking uh, profiles one by one, stitch them all together and get the 3D point cloud of the part. All this, uh, it looks complex, but uh, it's actually the visualization of what is happening under the hood and the user doesn't see it. So it is hidden from the user mm -hmm. and happens automatically under the hood. Groovy. So it looks very impressive. What are the key benefits? So there, are, there are three key benefits. Uh -huh. uh, it's speed, it's accuracy, and it's flexibility. Right. So the scanner scans each seam in seconds, not uh -huh. minutes. It's very accurate. It allows us to weld even deformed parts. And it's flexible, so you can use it for any parts of any shape and size. Great. So thank you for showing us this tech in action. And for more content like this, subscribe and see you next time.